welcome to check balance in this video i will be showing you how to use git in visual studio code so the first thing we're going to do open your visual studio code just check whether you have git installed in your machine with the git hyphen hyphen version command i have git installed in machine if you don't have git go over to the git website and download git for your operating system so the next thing i'm going to do is just go to my settings search for git enabled so this is what i'm looking for so this means the git is enabled in our visual studio code so make sure this is checked um, so the next thing i'm going to do is open a project that i want to push to github so, so make sure all your project files are under one folder so my project has has just three my project has three files and i'm going to push all those files to github so you click on the version control icon on github then click on initialize repo after you do that uh, put in a commit message i'll put in first commit then i click yes so the next thing i'm going to do is push push to github so you'll see you'll be warned your repository has no remote so i need to add a remote repository where i'm going to 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 publish my the repo, the repo i'm going to publish my project to on github so you need to allow your vs code to access your github it will load and take you to this page click continue then just sign in to your github account so the next thing i'm going to do i'm going I he i'll head over to github and create a new repo i'll just call it demo project then i'll you can add a readme file or not then you just create this repo and so after you do that head over to vs code and go to remote add remote select add remote from github uh, since you your vs code is linked to github you can just see a list of your repos here so i'll just select the one i've created or let me just type the name demo project then i'll press enter after i do that i come here again push to so you'll see this repo has been added here i'll just select it then this is pushing my changes to github but you can just click here to publish your your changes so uh, let's head over to one of the files and just make a change let me change the title of this Then I'll save it. Also, you'll see there's, there's changes here. Means there's one change I've made, so I, I need to commit these changes. So I've stayed these changes. The next thing I'm going to do is just commit these changes. Then 
then I'll do the same and push the changes. So that's basically how to add an existing project that is on your local machine to your GitHub account. So first make sure all your files are under one folder. Uh, make sure you have your GitHub account and authorize access from Visual Studio Code to GitHub. So the next thing we're going to do, let me just open up a new window. Uh, click on version control so it gives you option of opening a folder or clone repo so if you want to clone a, a repo from github that you've been given a link you just come here you can select clone from github uh, so i'm gonna clone one of of the repos i built years ago and um it gives an option to select where you want to clone your repository on your local machine. So I'll just select document. Then it will give me this cloning git repository. So you give it time. Then would you like to open? Yeah, you can open it in new window. So you can just see this file here. can see this file here that I've just cloned from my from my repository uh, so let's just head over to github so you can see the changes have been put to the master branch you can see um, this is basically what I pushed to GitHub from the Visual Studio Code. Uh, so thank you everyone. And uh, that's all for today. Don't forget to subscribe.